This is a 12 foot long Sono tube. There's the uh, halfway mark, so it's six feet. This is a 24 inch diameter. I will show you how to make a uh, 24 inch diameter fiberglass mold using a 24 inch Sono tube. both sides before you uh, cut otherwise you'll have to tape since one side is already cut when without the tape the sono tube loses its shape so it's harder to draw that second line that's why it's important to draw both lines in the beginning before you start cutting <laughs> the size of your flange, adjust your 1x8 and your furring strips to that uh, right dimension so that I try to target for about an inch, inch and a half. Once you have the right dimensions, secure the 1x8 to your horse and then the furring strips onto the 1x8 and then tape, tape the, uh, the wood so it doesn't stick with the fiberglass. I marked the 28.75 ounces of resin on the, uh, the plastic container. It's easier to see, especially when you're working, uh, when you're really working fast. it's a large diameter I placed the uh, fiberglass mats on the on the form first 
trying this out. I did it both ways. First with the uh, fiberglass mats on top, and then the second time I did it with, uh, with just the Sono tube, and then add the fiberglass mats. It's easier to actually do the mats first. no special cleanup associated with this form. While we're putting it in the fields and, and installing the gaskets, we find out where it leaks and then we sand it and clean it up until we find it can uh, hold concrete without uh, seepage. Mm -hmm. 